What's up guys, happy Monday. It's time to take a look at the latest Samsung news. The smartphone lineup for which Samsung is sacrificing everything, that is Galaxy Z lineup. We're gonna be talking about the Fold 3. Some epic, exciting surprises are coming. Last month, during the official announcement of the Exynos 2100 processor, Samsung officially said, we're working with AMD to create a new chip that will come with the next flagship product. The only next flagship product that Samsung will be releasing in 2021 is the Galaxy Z series, which includes the Z Fold 3 and the Z Flip 3. According to South Korean media, the Exynos 2200 processor with AMD GPU will go in mass production sometime around June and it could be used in the next flagship foldable devices, the Z Fold 3 and the Z Flip 3. This is a pretty exciting news because we have heard that the first Exynos AMD chip will come inside a Samsung laptop. The problem here is that I don't think their laptops are flagship product. The Galaxy Z Fold 3 definitely qualifies for that. And more importantly, as stated earlier, Samsung wants to bring this chip inside their next flagship product. With the new AMD GPU combined with the under panel camera on one of the displays, plus for the first time the official support for S Pen, this might just be the perfect replacement for the Galaxy Note 21 Ultra for now. Also, South Korean media has reported that Samsung has figured out the way to bring the S Pen to the Fold 3. Apparently, they're using a foldable digitizer under the screen, which will allow the display to withstand the pressure applied using the S Pen on the screen. We're not sure if the S Pen will come built in with the Fold 3 like we have seen on the Note devices. I personally think it won't because they already are offering S Pen separately, and then of course the S Pen Pro coming later down the year. The Fold 3 is shaping up to be a monumental product. This is by far the most exciting rumors and leaks regarding the Fold 3. I really hope that it does happen. As always, we'll hear more stuff from more notable sources in the coming days. Now, speaking of the foldable devices, Huawei officially announced their Mate X2 foldable phone. It is their first infolding foldable device that works very similar to the Galaxy Z Fold 2, but it does a lot of things better than the Fold 2, which I think Samsung can definitely pick up and implement implement on the upcoming Fold 3. Unlike the Fold 2's weird 25 by 9 narrow aspect ratio for the outer display, the Mate X2 offers a wider 21 by 9 display which is almost like a traditional smartphone display so most of your current apps they will continue to work. You get a proper smartphone to tablet experience. Because of how good the outer screen is on the Mate X2, there is no need to put a camera sensor on the main tablet screen. The Mate X2 also offers 90Hz refresh rate on both displays. It definitely creates a consistent experience, which is something that Samsung should do with their Z Fold 3 by having a 90Hz outer screen to conserve battery and 120Hz refresh rate with the inner tablet screen. The Mate X2 is the world's best foldable phone when it comes to camera. The camera specs of the Mate X2 are pretty much on the same level as the Galaxy S21 Ultra. You're getting that dual zoom, periscope camera system, and a massive camera lens. This is one area where the Z Fold 2 kind of falls short, so even if they don't bring the periscope camera system, the main camera lens has to be at least on the same level as the S21 Ultra's main camera. So these were some of the notable things that I hope Samsung adopts on their Fold 3. As for the Mate X2, it's pretty sad that this device will probably not gonna get any sale outside of China. The price is really high and of course, there are no Google services. Anyways, that's all the latest news. The upcoming Galaxy Z lineup is definitely the most important Samsung devices in 2021. If you guys don't know, the Galaxy Buds Pro giveaway is live on the channel. You can check out the link in the description if you wanna enter. With that being said, I'll catch you guys later. Peace out.